Hello, good morning, everyone. We're back again. I'm sitting on this stationary bike, distracting myself from all this exercise by playing Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, doing a 100% warpless run. As we can see, we have traveled quite a bit all over Hyrule, all over most of Hyrule. Um, we were just uh, cleaning up some stuff in the Akala region up here. We're going to meet Kilton for the first time, and then eventually we're going to, well, after collecting some things here, we're going to make our way across the North Shore here, do the Tiflo Ruins, and eventually head over to Rio Village. So, today is going to be part of that journey. Um, so let's get started. First thing to do is get to that shrine. get our salvager vest, which is one of the Xenoblade Chronicle items. Good morning. Oh, gotta turn on... Gotta turn off Pixel Chat Preview. Ah, so excuse me. So we may, the roof protect. we may all be seeing a bunch of chats flashing by, and That's I'm realizing... Thank you, actually. is pointing out that... Uh, that is part of the thing. I tried to integrate the the tr the uh, chat onto the actual video that I'm recording since I'm rec posting this to YouTube now. Okay, go to the website and go to your overlay and turn off the preview there. Well, if everyone will just bear with me for a few moments. Urbosa's fury is ready. Yeah, it's still showing the sample. I am working on that. Uh, pixel chat overlay. Uh, so that should be toggle preview mode. And that looks like it has stopped. Okay, so I think we're in good working order at this point. Okay, back on track, hopefully. Um, okay, so anyway, I believe what I need to do is do a fire. night. <laughs> ah, you can see how long your delay is. Yes, is it significant, I guess? It's like 30 seconds. Well, I suppose this is how it, this is how it goes. All right. Like nine, five, I'm gonna look up when the when this is supposed to. Happen. 
I think 30 seconds is probably good, because it's usually more than that for me to even see it. Eastern sky from the snow's left eye. That's where we are. I didn't miss it, right? There's a... There, I try this again. Bit by bit until tomorrow night. Raining. 9 p.m. once again. There it is. Okay, so that's there, and hopefully that stays there fairly indefinitely, or at least with enough time for me to say hello to our friend Hilton here, and then walk over. That's a picture of his back. Does that work? I don't think it does. That's it? Did I get- did my picture even work? Doesn't have a little quest marker. Which means I have to go find him again. And take a picture of his face. Unfortunate. Now I've got to climb my way back up here, and hopefully that armor is still there. Yeah, that lake does have creepy flowers below the surface. We're not even gonna look now. There's no need to get it. Let's see how creepy it is. It is unfortunate that it's raining, because that means we can't climb. Hell, oh, these guys are red Lazalfas. I think we need to fight them. Fry boomerang is pretty good.
Got some parts there. That's pretty good. Uh, where is this even? Ah, so this is right here, right south of Skull Lake. There, yeah, it's this weird. I almost want to call it bone-like. These rocks look like. I feel like I don't usually do a lot of rolling around inside this. It stops raining. Can't go up. But we can collect plenty of red Lizalfos tails, so I guess that's. So I have to buy and take a picture of all of Kilton's gear too? Um, no, I just need a picture of Kilton himself. Because one of the guards at the horse stable near the tech lab thought him suspicious and wanted a picture. But I do need to just buy all of this stuff. I guess I should put on night gear. But Hyrule Snap? No, Kilton is not one of the targets for the Hyrule Compendium. The Hyrule Compendium requires critters and weapons and enemies and resources, but not NPCs, I guess, thankfully. Now we got that done. Oh, Dinrel again. Another Dinrel that we are not making. That's okay, we will be getting something off of him as we pass through, because I'm not going to pass through his area and not, not wait for him. Yeah, I mean, I need to, uh... Oh, you know what? I think he does sell weapons. I will need to photograph the weapons he sells. But the masks, just like all armor, there's no... masks, uh, slots, or armor equipment slots in the Hyrule Compendium. Again, I think thankfully. Also, because you can't, most of them, you can't, um, just drop on the ground. Uh, so... You'd only be able to take a picture of ones that could get sold in shops.
Got a little turn around. This is the way we need to go. Also, we need to climb to the top of Gut Check Rock over there, because there was a Korok steed that we didn't weren't able to do because I threw the uh, rock off of the place that I needed it to go. So since we're in the neighborhood, we'll give that one another attempt. Got the Hinox over here, so we don't need to fight that again. And we will steer clear. Uh, oh, that was a that was something I would have liked to grab. Those are these hot springs? Not healing based on ankle deep, uh, standing in ankle deep water. That looks like a lizard of some type. We're gonna get it. We'll probably pick up like five darners along the way. It was that simple, and I missed it. Yeah. All right, that's that's a core rock done. Yeah. On to Dinrel's hideout or appearance spot. Right there, there's a Korok seed. Let's get it. This. What manner of Korok seed is this? Blow up the boulders, pick up the rock underneath. Alright, it's boulders. In here, no doubt. Yeah, this is pretty. There we go. Yeah. 
And that's another Korok seed done. Those lazy horns. Barn horns because I am slow. That is true. Slow and steady like the door. Ooh, Ruby. Nice. Couple hundred. Ooh, and a sapphire. Um. Right here. I mean, I guess there I could move forward and there's a Talus to fight. And another Korok seed to get. Looks like I'm dipping, dipping into Death Mountain a little bit here. There's a lizard right there. I think that lizard probably ran away. Yeah. Oh. Hey, wait, I want that stuff. Igneo Peblets, I think we got them. Yeah. We got them. I'm headed this way across that bridge. Also likely a good place to pick up smother wing butterflies, which I will definitely need. Drop that. Pick that up. Let's get our parts before they burn. Yep. Okay, onward. This is not a breakable rock. Oh. I don't like it with all this. Right there. All right, what can we draw for the cobble crusher? For a cobble crusher? I don't think we need a torch. Let's.
Ah, there is our Igneo Talus. First, a picture for the records. Igneo Talus. Check. Let's put ice arrows. And I guess, yeah, this cobble crack is probably the right decision. taken. It's here. Let's heal up. Can I be more fireproof? Let's let's eat something just in case. That was, uh, wasn't as smooth as I hoped. But we got him. That's what matters. Let's mark this guy down. Done. Let's get this Korok seed, which is at the top of something I need to climb. Remove that pin. Add a pin there. That's where I need to go. Yeah. Ugh. Alright, that's another Korok seed down. Okay, so... Next... We go right about here... There? Yeah, right there, there's 300 rupees. That's on our way to the skeleton, which is where Dinrel shows up. So that's where we're going. Hmm. 
the better sword, probably, than this. Here, let's use these spears. Somewhere around here is a treasure chest, supposedly. Is it caught in a cave here? Yeah, it's gotta be right there. Hundo. Okay, now what I think I should do or not Korok, Octorok. Rock to rock. Mother one butterfly right there. Let's grab that. Summer wing, actually. Okay. That's where we want to go. That's where we're going to see Dinral. Let's set up a camp here. Wait until 9, because he usually appears at midnight, if I have that correct. Don't feel like that. Waiting for me. Shouldn't we have had to crawl out of the ground and spawn? In any event. Out. Didn't rally yet. <laughs> ah, grab that lizard. I'll try boomerang. Running out of room. Didn't really yet. 
Leave that. There's the skeleton. comes right on time all right we've got this bow that's as good as any regular arrows something fireproof would probably be good just in case just in case make it two things fireproof if that's the case then sure climb may have And I'm gonna try and go for like this horn or something or a claw, something something tough. A little too late. Ah, oh, that missed, and I. Oh, maybe it did hit his horn. See what we got. Horn. Okay, that was a good one. <laughs> you remember the first playthrough I waited here for so long? Yeah, I did. And that's gonna happen again. I'm gonna have to farm. The rate I'm getting, I'm collecting dragon parts is like nowhere near close enough to what I'll need for the end of the game. So at one point we'll have to do that. Um. Oh, there is a Korok seed here, but it's complete the circle of rocks, and there is a Lionel here, so maybe we'll go and fight this Lionel, so he does not interfere with our core rocking. White Mane is probably up there. Best pants. I've got my best defense pants on. Sure, let's do that. Go for the raw claim. All right, let's heal first. Where are we going? Fight a Lionel. If I start off with a shock arrow or something. So many shock arrows.
Could have eaten something with Attacka. Next time I need to heal. That hurt a lot. Um, alright. Is that uh, strength food I thought I had? Now let's do that. There we go. That's the hits we want. It's not for fighting Lionels, what is it for? Savage Lionel Sword. Mark that one. What else we got? Savage Lionel Bow. Savage Lionel Bow. Do I have Savage Lionel Shield yet? I... Ah, I don't have room for that, that's fine. Didn't have a picture, let's take a picture. Shield, check. Where are we? 816, still got time, let's drop a crappy shield. Okay. Pretty well. Uh, yeah, let's use that. Let's use that. And let's get back to that Korok seed that I was worried about. Um, where is that? Right here, there's the circle. Yeah, 
And the rock is over here somewhere, which is why we need to deal with that line off. I see those lizards. I don't see those lizards. Oh, there's the rock. Another Korok down. Yeah. Alright, and now we've got a bit of a walk. Just traveling west for a while. Our next stop is like down here somewhere. Anyway, we'll pick up critters along the way. Oh, that butterfly. I would have liked to grab that. Alright. Next time. There is another Lionel down there, too. Oops. Sneaky spear hunting. I love it. Uh, I should mark this so that I don't completely miss it. Yeah, wait, because Tiff. Tiff will run through here. There's, there's a Korok here. There's a Korok here. There's a Korok and a Lionel here. Let's do the top, the North Shore ones, because I don't want to go into Fifth Floor Ruins now, because that's a longer thing. So, now I'm going to go straight. Wait, where am I? I'm sorry, I am all turned around. Yeah, I'm going to go straight to the blue, which is to pick up the rocks. I was probably at the top of a ledge or something. That looks like a magnesis puzzle. That's a pick up the rock. This is the magnesis puzzle. Okay. Now I got it. Another Korok. Let's go. Let's do the red one. The red one is a two balloons. Favorite. Is that the same Islander hawk that I always see? I guess so. Like, there, I know that there's nothing else in the compendium. 
that. The compendium birds I'm missing are... There's two, two different types of sparrow. I think that's it. Got there's a pinwheel, I'm right. Oh, there's one. Hide and seek. There's one, it is. Okay, I like hide and seek better than moving targets. Still not done. There it is. All right, that car rocks down. There is another balloon game. Oof, it's all the way over here. But when else am I gonna get it? There's another Korok there. There's another Korok about there. So these are all of the things I need to get and then do the Tiflo runes. Tiflo runes. Uh let's go fight this Lionel. That's more fun. We got the uh the one down here. Two different species of Hylian sparrows that I don't have yet. I've already gotten three. I've had first Hylian sparrow, yes. What about second? And fifth. There's the ruins. Straight across. Got five minutes left. What manner of Korok seed is this? This is a pick up the rock, that's easy. There's, I think that's the rock. And then we actually don't even need to fight the Lionel. I mean, he's probably having a bad day as it is. It's raining. Where he is, even. Um, okay, so let's, well, let's delete that. I just heard lightning, so let's equip a Thunder Helm. Avoid that problem altogether. Let's look at this map. Let's head towards the green pin. This way. 
And yeah, we should be. We'll make a little progress towards the green pin, but then probably call it a day. Do we want to climb? That's the question. Yeah, we're going to have to climb a bit. How far can we climb in the rain? This slope actually doesn't look too bad. Especially right there. Let's try over here. Oh, look, it's not even raining here. We're gonna, I think we're gonna make it. The, the Korok seed that I'm going to get is a shoot the acorn out of a tree, which is a very easy one to do. Let's go there, get that acorn, call it a day there. I guess this is the proper entrance to the ruins. seed down and then I've got two actually the entrance all right whatever um all right we will pick up tomorrow right about here uh no not tomorrow today's Friday hey isn't that fun and wonderful we'll pick up here Monday and uh yeah continue on collecting stuff anyway thanks for hanging out hope you all have a great weekend and I'll see you next time later